Hello guys, Mikjub here and welcome back to another Slime is Kind of Memory and today it is day 109 of me playing this game as free to play. This video is going to be uploaded tomorrow probably, uh, so it's going to be 810, day 810, yes. I just want to record right now because I had to prepare for tomorrow since I have a tournament. Um, so we're going to be talk about, I don't know, there weren't that many stuff this month, but just... Uh, a lot of free stuff that we got free tickets we got a lot of free tickets uh new year of course it, it was new year so we got we got two tickets right that we have login bonus that is really nice we got more tickets more um magic crystal to log in we are also getting guaranteed there are some tickets that were, we are getting available later on which is gonna be used on my next video which is gonna be on february now this uh this month we have the new meta uh, new Year blessing which i'm not i don't know i, re I really enjoy it uh since i got shion and rimuru yeah i got shion pretty early uh for my free tickets but for rimuru i had to go for the pity uh to get him which is really sad so i wasted a lot of magic crystal which i said i was going to save my magic crystal just to secure if they're gonna be another collab so i need around between 9000 12000 9,000, 12,000 magic crystal used to be in the safe spot, but that backfired because I thought I would get a rumor early, but I went full pity, so yeah, that happened. So I think I'm gonna go safe mode, yeah, for entire time for now. Just keep saving, keep banners, just keep saving magic crystal and farm whatever event they are available to give me some magic crystal. And we also did a beat, beat down battle. Uh, I did Inferno, I, fi I believe Extreme 2. I believe I finished it. Uh, I, didn't, I don't want to continue since they are really hard and I don't want to try hard that. But I got most lane shop from the beat battle. And then we have a really hard event, which I actually was able to beat if you haven't seen my video, which is the Conquest. Heavily the Conquest is Stone Dragon. And that one was really hard. Uh, I did explain, I did many retries, tried to beat it, used to get the perfect hand, uh, try to not mess up, uh, do no mistakes, because it's a lot of RNG in that uh, when it comes to orb. Sometimes you do get a lot of blue orb, sometimes a lot of green or orange. Uh, it depends what team you use, right? And since I use the Vision Coleos team, so I, that means I really want a lot of blues, but I did not get a lot of blues, so I had to retry, retry, get a perfect hand, and you have to like retry on turn one, either for the first turn or the second turn. If you are able to get a perfect turn on one and two, then the rest is should be able. Now I do wish they keep releasing like maybe release uh, this type of uh, event like every month, once a month. That will be really nice. Uh, just to keep up to have more content to do or something because we right now most of people are like long time players I, I've been playing this game for two years so long time players have to do something right other than you just keep farming the auto battle right uh, parallel process and yeah heavily conquest was something new that they br brought back it, it was so long time we had a uh, really hard content to do last time conquest was probably last year um six months ago or something like it was a long time ago right and yeah i really enjoy uh i wish they uh have this more frequently right and next we had vala cup season 14 i believe right season 14 so this one was kind of interesting pretty hard uh, you either use the sparkle team the pretty sparkle team to be able to beat it which probably some people did it but I was surprised that I ended up at rank 28 at the end. Uh, what team I used was um, a mix of Neo Blessing because they were really good actually for this Vela Cup. So yeah, and the DPS or the damage dealer was going to be uh, the Summer Milam, the Dark Milam there. The Summer Dark Milam, she is really, really good in uh, Vela Cups uh, and many, many time. In backup, you're mostly looking for DPS and so Milim is one of the popular that was used. Now, the only issue I'd had was that I don't have the Bride Shuna or uh, the Summer Hinata because they are really good when it comes to stealing orbs for himself and then you can use 
uh, switch them out for Milam. Uh, since I don't have that, I had to use Diablo, which is somewhat alright to use. Uh, some replaceable, but not the best thing. Though, if you do get 3 Diablo Orb, then it's really nice because you can use. Uh, give it to Rimuru because he's as high as attack and you switch Rimuru out for Milim. so yeah that was my strategy for all time and I did win all four battles so that's why I end up really high, high rank but it's not my best rank because my best rank was already 28 but not bad though not bad I top 50 that's good uh, one day maybe I'll reach top 10 some hopefully top 10 that is actually my goal for this year try to get top 10 and also top 10 on here you play but we'll see i really need some real real luck like really crazy luck but yeah or i'm gonna talk more about val cup on other video because they have reset the reward and stuff i want to actually um, talk about it but another day right so we had more stuff i believe we got milim that got released we got Sh uh shinsha that got released then they added predator battle so everyone can farm but yeah um then they added the Demon Lord Lum uh, Luminous, right? Uh, I forgot what the name, something like Sangun, something Sangun Dance. So that is a small event where we fight against uh, the Demon Lord, of course. Uh, that one was actually hard to do, but I was uh, able to beat it. Now, I wasn't able to do all the mission because they were really hard to do. But I was able to get all the platinum hammer because they were really important. But the rest was like you need to like have uh, all orbs. So we had full combo orange, full combo of blue, full combo of green. But yeah, um, I didn't complete all the mission. But I gonna use gonna do auto battle or use do parallel progress to get the currency, then trade uh, the stuff from the shop. And I do need to do around fifty more battles. Um, the parallel progress because if you do 100 battles you do get a free ticket so for every single 10 battles you get a free ticket up to uh, 100 battle which give you in total 10 tickets and uh, use the standard uh, ticket so you're gonna use them from the standard banner not the temperance recruit next what do we have we had uh, what more did we have we have here you believe which is currently right now and uh, Actually, let's talk about Hero Believe because I think there is one event that hasn't released yet, which is the uh, Corridor of Awakening. That one isn't released yet, so we're gonna wait for that. So, yeah, uh, so lastly, we're gonna talk about Hero Jubilee. Um, Hero Jubilee, this is Hero Jubilee Season 33 and Nor Battle 1. Now, Nor Battle 1 and 2 was pretty easy because I used to have to follow um, Ice, Yo Ice Cold Joker's build or setup for the team. I used uh, copy, yet inspiration, tried to use that. Of course, I don't have every single team, of course. Um, but Nor Battle 1 and 2, I did it in one try. <laughs> Somehow, I was really lucky to get really good um, orb. So yeah, uh, though, Nor Battle 3, that one was actually really hard because your main damage was the World of Fantasy Milim, right? So uh, you didn't need it to get some decent orb, a uh, correct orb, and also have some uh, Milim orb to do. And I was real unlucky to not get that many. I ended up always get either one or two Milim. You need at least three Milim because the orange or the rainbow orb gives a lot. So it take, took many tries and I also tried to uh, get some good buffer for her which I didn't have so I was lacking a lot of damage I would say or, or total damage or buff so yeah but I did end up really high rank so that's really really fine with that and we also had boss battle right boss battle is a five turn limit so you have to deal a lot of damage within the five turns so the first one was the AOE, so I don't have the Millen near Millen right, so I have to rely on oh Shizu, the Wind Shizu, EX Shizu. Um, she was going to be my DPS for now, the AOE, so I had to use some buffer and stuff. Not the perfect, I feel like I was lacking a lot of damage or I'm missing something. So I just did it 
I believe only one try uh, because I didn't want to retry too many times and uh, yeah it was not the best score but somehow it's still fine and it's still like three days left until they hear the bleed end so the try harders or the people that are doing the last day haven't played yet so I just wanted to play it right now so I don't miss anything and the last one boss battle 2 which is a single target focus the main, my main damage dealer was going to be the of course near blessing Rimuru. She is the magic damage dealer, but I don't have the only issue I have was probably damage or buffer. I did not have the perfect setup, but I didn't want to retry too many times or spend too many times on both battles. So yeah, uh, hopefully it's still enough score. So I and I believe I ended up at rank. Uh, 20 something 20 between 20 and 30 but that can go up so i'm gonna end up probably like top 0 0.02 percent something like that 0.2 percent yeah uh, so my goal was just to try to reach top uh, 0.3 percent that is the, our main goal and yeah hopefully it's, it's enough to get some magic crystal because i need a lot of magic crystal to save so it's gonna be a lot a lot of skipping for now onwards if they do end up releasing something crazy i have to skip because hopefully they're not going to be another collab if they don't that means the uh, the, the meta that are going to be on each new month gonna be there we can we'll be able to get them and later on so this month wasn't that a lot of stuff but we did yet end up a lot of free stuff so yeah I mean that's right so hopefully we'll see what next month gonna be uh, since this was the new year and uh, now maybe they're gonna release something like all right since in february they're gonna be a uh, happy valentine right so valentine theme so we'll see uh, what type of valentine gonna be that is just my prediction so yeah I think that was everything I want to cover, so I will move on now and you guys will see my present me where I showcase the account, which I didn't do that last time. So, see you soon. Hello, hello, and welcome back to present me. And yeah, so last time I did not show my account because I was really quickly uh, tried to record and upload it, right? But this time, let's showcase uh, my current account for this month. And currently I'm in the bamboo um, bamboo land, which I haven't touched for a while because I tried to max out the other building first. Once I have maxed that out, I will go back to bamboo and try to max the stuff there, the yeah, other building. And uh, there's nothing now in the trading, so I'm gonna not uh, trade or exchange something. But let's see, bond leveling. Um, currently, a lot of characters is close to level 30, so that's nice. I'm still trying to max them out. So after 30, I'm gonna try to ma try to reach them to 40 because that is gold because we had a bingo mission. But that's gonna take a while. So we're gonna do step by step. Try to do first 30, then 35, then 40. That is my goal for now. And we still don't have rain, so we're missing a lot of free magic crystal there. Yo, Next we have the gear um, since I did not get that many new stuff so I've been just trying to level up um, trying to max out uh, Diablo's gear because he's dark and you know I like dark so those that are dark you not get the uh, um, you know uh, the special treatment and I do have light removed gear that I've been farming but yeah and Violet you see she's using Mirai she's gonna get her gear soon but I work on it I try to need to for more flashback crystal and for charm i have a lot i haven't touched it for a while um, but i need to level them up i do have actually more and uh, you might see in the gift box 81 new stuff that i accept yet because there's a lot, lot of new stuff we have free tickets as well this is from the valley cup so these are just the new stuff uh, which i can claim later on you just need to sorting sorting off so yeah, I also have Mad Crystal laying around. So I don't actually have 750 right now. I probably have around 1000. But for now, they're gonna be in my gift box because they're not gonna disappear within 30 days, right? Uh, new, did we get any new characters? We did, we did get this one. We took me with the full pity. So he was kind of worth it, I would say. 
but hopefully it's gonna be more worth in the future. We did yet Shion, we did yet another dupe for her when we tried to get uh, Rimuru. So she is right now 108. So two dupes. Uh, so we did get one free dupe and then we get another copy. And she is the currently highest level for EX Protector. As you can see, she is level 108. And my next one is 104, 104, 104, and 100. So she yet is the highest one. Then we had the Benamu. I haven't used him that much, but he seems alright. She he's kind of feels like the same level as uh, the older protector that I've had before. So he can be really good if you have him. And now we don't need to go through the tower, right? So we just can go for the events. Uh, events, I will talk about them. Um, or talk, talk about the most. Uh, beat battle down. Oh, I actually did, did do Inferno 1, but I'm not gonna do Inferno 2 because it's really hard. And there's some mission that I can really do because it's really hard. So, yeah, I'm gonna miss some magic crystal, but we'll see if I can retry it. We'll see. And uh, now, Hedge Bleed. I don't think I show my current rank, right? So, here. My current rank is 22, so I'm actually at 0.5%, uh, so I'm gonna be around over 1% uh, when the people are actually really trying. This is my current score, and uh, not the best thing, but as, as long as it's 1%, either under or above 1% is nice. So they, they will do for now, good for now, I'm not gonna retry again, because I'm pretty much done with Hero Bleed. And boss battle, not the best thing, but this is my highest score for now, so I am guessing I'm gonna be around 1%, so at least top uh, 100 or even above 100, we'll see, we'll see. So if we look, compare with the score, you can see the rank 1 has 6000k, I mean 600k, right, 600k points, so that is a lot of big difference, and yeah, I'm pretty sure that you can improve, but yeah. So hopefully we do end up 1%, under 1%, but that's fine if we end up between 3%, that is fine. And they still uh, use 500 or 50 magic crystal different, so that's fine. And next we have Valkup, right? Valkup, you see uh, everything has been resetted. Uh, we'll talk more about it in another video, but this is actually really nice for those that are new or for those that are long players. So yeah, uh, you can see I end up rank 28 and on season 12 I also end up at rank 28. So yeah, not my highest score or highest rank. So yeah, rank 28 is my best so far. Hopefully I can beat that, but yeah. And I think that was everything I need to cover for this video. So thank you guys for watching this video. I hope you guys enjoy my commentary for this month. And hopefully we see something interesting for next month with new meta and stuff. But yeah, we'll see. Hopefully Bandai will surprise us, but yeah, that's for me, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys next time, take care now, and bye bye.